seen the Avatar lately? Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Avatar The Last Airbender. Yes, we are getting, eh, not even really midway quite yet, but it is getting pretty interesting if I do say so myself. Um, this episode we are jumping into is part two, uh, because the last time we had part one, and it is the winter solstice, and we found out that we have to go to the Fire Nation to meet, uh, well, Roku? Uh, yes, Roku is in the real world a, uh... Well, a soundbar and a streaming device, uh, which is kind of interesting that they would name him Roku, but I'm sure that Roku actually means something in the language of origin. So, yes, very funny to me that they always call this guy Roku, um, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, this episode is, again, part two. The last episode, we had the uh, Spirit Panda attacking the village, and then uh, we met Avatar Roku and found out that we need to go to uh, the Fire Nation and uh, catch uh, the Winter Solstice ending so him and Aang can talk. So, with that being said, let's jump right into Avatar The Last Airbender. Here we go. Alright, this episode is... Book one, water, winter solstice, part two. And the city is still destroyed. Let's go, Appa! Come on, boy! And it looks like Aang is trying to sneak out. If they got hurt, I'd never forgive myself. True. So get your big butt off the ground and let's go! <laughs> I think his big butt is trying to tell you something. Right. Please don't go, Aang. The world can't afford to lose you to the Fire Nation. Neither can I. Right. We're not letting you go into the Fire Nation, Aang. At least not without your friends. We got your back. Ew! Ew. You'll have to fly fast to have any chance of making it before sundown. Right. Good luck. Thank you for your- Go! No time to talk, just go. <sighs> Huh. Having trouble sleeping? <laughs> wow, he got there fast. Seen the Avatar lately? Uh, last time we saw him, he was getting his uncle. Sailing into Fire Nation waters. Uh-oh. Of all the foolish things you've done in your 16 years, Prince Zuko. So we know he's 16 now. Oh, this is the most foolish. I have no choice, uncle. Yeah, you do. Come on. Have you forgotten that the Fire Lord banished you? Right. What if you're caught? I'm chasing the Avatar. My father will understand why I'm returning home. Eh, probably not. My brother is not the understanding type. <laughs> right. Helmsman! Full steam ahead! Aang, we got trouble! Yeah! And it's gaining fast! Right. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, catapult. A uh, stinky catapult. Ah, uh, really, Prince Zuko? Couldn't you shoot them down with something more fragrant? Right. Fireball! I'm on it! Wow, that was close. We have to get out of Zuko's range before he shoots another hot stinker at us! <laughs> yeah! Oh, come on, I got one more. Oh! Yeah! Oh, dragons! <laughs> okay, I just checked us out. I'll meet you at the car in minutes. <laughs> Hot stinker. Yeah, but there's just one little problem. A blockade. Right. Oh wow. It's a lot of ships. So they go this way and just keep rotating. Technically you were still in Earth Kingdom waters. Turn back now and they cannot arrest you. Okay, that's fair. You can go around the Fire Nation ships and avoid the blockade. It's the only way. There's no time! Right. This is exactly why I didn't want you to come. It's too dangerous. And that's exactly why we're here. Right. 
So you can either go really, really high, really, really low, or really, really fast. It captures you. There's nothing I can do. Right. I don't think Goko Iro is banished. I think he just went with his nephew because he needed to take care of him. Commander Zhao, what are your orders? Shoot the bison down, Captain. But there's a Fire Navy ship out there, sir. One of our own. What if it's hit? So be it. It belongs to a traitor. Okay. Yeah, Zuko is technically a traitor, even though he still flies the Fire Nation flag. Okay, so going into the clouds. Read Zuko! The engines are damaged! Uh-oh. Sokka's skydiving without a parachute. Ah! There you go. Ah! Wow. He blew a hole in that one. Where do you think the Avatar is headed, sir? I'm not sure. But I bet a certain banished prince will know. Right. We're on a collision course! Uh oh. The boarding party is ready to apprehend Prince Zuko, sir. Wait! Cut the engines and let them pass. Okay. It's kind of weird. But I think I know where he's getting going with this. There it is! The island where Roku's dragon took me! Oh, nice. It even has a lava bridge. Oh, you must be tired. No! Ugh, I'm good. Refreshed and ready to fight some firebenders. We weren't talking to you. I was talking to Appa. <laughs> I don't see any guards. The Fire Nation must have abandoned the temple when Avatar Roku died. Eh, maybe. I mean, it's depending on if it's uh, which temple it is, too. Wait. I think I heard something. Oh, hi, Mark. Uh oh. Oh boy. We are the Fire Sages, guardians of the Temple of the Avatar. The Fire Sages are old, but that might actually worth work for them because uh, they know how to firebend. Great! I am the Avatar. We know. And they know that he is the Avatar, and they do not care. I hold them off. Run! <laughs> So they're not very good monks. If the Avatar contacts Roku, there's no telling how powerful the boy will become. Split up and find him. Oh boy. Follow me! Do you know where you're going? Nope! Nope. <laughs> Come back! Not that way. I don't want to fight you. I am a friend. Maybe. I know why you're here, Avatar. You do? Okay. Yes. You wish to speak to Avatar Roku. Right. I can take you to him. How? <laughs> ah, secret door. There's another episode called Secret Tunnel. Yeah, I forget the next couple lines, but uh, then it goes... Secret Tunnel! Secret Tunnel! Secret, 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 secret tunnel, yeah! Tunnel, but we're not really close to that one yet. What's he up to, Uncle? Why didn't Commander Zhao arrest me? Be right. Because he wants to follow you. Yeah. He knows you'll lead him to the prize you're both after. The Avatar. Right. Zhao wants to follow our trail of smoke. Then that's exactly what I'll let him do. Huh. So he has a little plan going there, I guess. Did you know Avatar Roku? No, but my grandfather knew him. We all have a strong spiritual connection to this place. Okay. Is that how you knew I was coming? A few weeks ago, the statue of Avatar Roku, its eyes began to glow. Right. We're at the Air Temple. Avatar Roku's eyes were glowing there, too. At that moment, we knew you had returned to the world. Okay. The Avatar's temple. Why did the sages attack me? Things have changed. In the past, the sages were loyal only to the Avatar. Right. Roku died, 
The sages eagerly awaited for the next avatar to return, but he never came. Right. They were waiting for me. Hey, don't feel bad. You're only a hundred years late. Right. <laughs> when I learned you were coming, I knew I would have to betray the other sages. Right. Okay. Once you're inside, wait for the light to hit Avatar Roku's statue. Only then will you be able to speak with him. Right. <gasps> no! Uh-oh. The sanctuary doors, they're closed. Huh. Can't you just open them with fire bending? No. Only a fully realized avatar is powerful enough to open this door alone. Okay. The sages must open the doors together with five simultaneous fire blasts. Five fire blasts, huh? I think I can help you out. Maybe. Uncle, keep heading north. Zhao will follow the smoke trail while I use it as a cover. Hmm. This is a little trick I picked up from my father. I seal the lamp oil inside an animal skin casing. Shayu lights the oil soaked twine and ta da! Fake fire bending. Okay, so he just made a bomb. Uh-oh, here we go. Nice. <laughs> Nothing. Why won't it open? Because you're using air bending. I don't get it. That blast looked as strong as any fire bending I've seen. Right. Sokka, you're a genius! Huh, okay. How is Sokka a genius? His plan didn't even work. Right. You're right. Sokka's plan didn't work, nope. but it looks like it did. Okay. Did the definition of genius change in the last hundred years? I mean, maybe. Definitions of things have changed over the last, like, four years, so... He's inside! Open the doors immediately! <laughs> oh. <laughs> he must have crawled through the pipes! Right. <laughs> Uh-oh. How's your chance? The Avatar's coming with me. Oh, look who showed up. There you go, just in time. And... the Avatar state? Light hits the statue and I talk to Roku. Right. Wow. Avatar Roku doesn't want us inside. Yep. I don't know what I'm doing! All I know is airbending! Please, Avatar Roku, talk to me! There we go. It's good to see you, Aang. What took you so long? Oh, you know, I was in an ice cube for a hundred years. Why did you help the Avatar? Because it was once the Sage's duty. It is still our duty. Right. What a moving and heartfelt performance. Oh, this guy. He's back. It was a noble effort, but your little smoke screen didn't work. Eh, kind of. He got there before you. The Avatar's inside and the doors are sealed. Right. Sooner or later, he has to come out. That's fair. I have something very important to tell you, Aang. Right. One hundred years ago, Fire Lord Sozin used that comet to begin the war. Right. He and his firebending army harnessed its incredible power and dealt a deadly first strike against the other nations. Wow. So the comet made them stronger? Yes, stronger than you could even imagine. Well, yeah. Sozin's comet will return by the end of this summer, and Fire Lord Ozai will use its power to finish the war once and for all. If he succeeds, even the Avatar won't be able to restore balance to the world. Man. You must defeat the Fire Lord before the comet arrives. But I haven't even started learning waterbending. Right. Mastering the elements takes years of discipline and practice. But if the world is to survive, you must do it by summer's end. Wow. Bunch of homework to do. What if I have questions? How will I talk to you? I am a part of you. When you need to talk to me again, you will find a way. Right. A great danger awaits you at the temple. Okay. I can help you face the threat, but only if you are ready. I guess he's ready. <laughs> Avatar 
Roku took over his body. There we go. No! Wow, just melted them off. Arturo Roku is going to destroy the temple. We have to get out of here. Not without Aang. Aang's avatar Roku. He'll be fine. We got your back. Thanks. At least you didn't pass out this time. <gasps> nice. <laughs> Momo stole um, one of the monk's hats. No prince. No avatar. Disappeared into the clouds. The only thing I do have is five traitors. But Commander, only Shayu helped the avatar. Right. Save your stories for the Fire Lord. Uh oh. As far as I'm concerned, you are all guilty. I guess. And that is it. Let's talk about it. All right, guys. So that was Avatar: The Last Airbender, Winter Solstice Part Two. Pretty interesting episode, if I do say so myself. Um, was it my favorite episode? No, but you guys know my favorite episode already. Um, it is the, um, the storytelling episode where everyone gets kind of a story on their own. Um, this one was very good on building the story up and giving us a new assignment. So, our new assignment is to go and, uh, train and become a fully realized avatar before summer, which is pretty hard because sometimes it takes avatars years to become fully realized avatars. So yeah, I mean, it kind of uh, doesn't help that he missed a hundred years of training, but that is what happens when you run away from your monk place. Uh, so, with that being said, again, pretty decent episode. It builds up a lot of the storyline. Uh, we did get Fire Lord Roku, or not Fire Lord Roku, we got Avatar Roku telling us what was going on with Sozin's Comet coming, and what Sozin himself did back when Aang disappeared, which would have made him pretty old because uh, Avatar Roku looked decently old when he uh, passed, at least if the form that he's taking is his last uh, adult self, uh, then yeah, he looked pretty old. So um, it did say that the comet makes uh, the firebenders hugely stronger than they typically would be. So that is a huge issue, especially since uh, the Fire Nation is trying to take over the world. So with that being said, all in all, a good episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you do, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, go ahead and give it a thumbs down. That's okay. I can take it and no one sees it anyways. If you guys aren't, uh, if you guys would like to subscribe, go ahead and hit that little subscribe button that's down here in the corner. If you're on your computer, if not, it's down somewhere. Uh, in your description or it will be popped up up here for you when we end somewhere around here and so go ahead and give that a little tap for me all you got to do is just tap it in just tap it in if you guys aren't quite ready to subscribe there will be two playlists popping up right around here for you and uh, you can watch those series of Archie Bunker and uh, the beginning of this series, um, Avatar The Last Airbender. So I want to thank all of my subscribers. I want to thank you guys for getting this far in the video. And we will see you next time. Peace.